Contestant dropped out to be last of all at the 550 up nearing the turn. It's Euro Sun that leads the way. Held to the painters off the bit and he's being ridden with great gusto. On the inside, excellently he's tracking through now on the back of Euro Sun. Pushed a pass and dropped off then King of Woo. The flirt sticking towards the inside. Next contestant comes to the outside with Paddy in the straight. Euro Sun booted clear led two lengths excellently. The flirt over towards the inside. Further back King of Woo and then Paddy Star Exhibit getting home along the rails very quickly. Euro Sun the leader. Here comes Star Exhibit though. It's Star Exhibit driving up on the inside. Grab the lead. And what a great rails hugging ride it is. A gloomy day with the weather and the rain. And Bob, the results haven't quite gone the way uh, you would have liked. But a good way to finish. Yes, it's always nice to finish on a good note. Um, we've had a few seconds and a couple of fifths. And uh, it's nice to get a winner. Tell us about the ride there of William Pike, obviously forced to go the rails and was going to need some luck at the top of the straight, decided to stick that way, but this guy just responded so well. Well, William knows he can do that sort of thing and uh, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. He's lightly raced, but I feel like this guy's got a couple of quirks as well. We saw Darren allude to the fact that he had the blanket going in, the blindfold as well, and then uh, Pike, he doesn't want to seem to draw the whip on him too often as well. Is he a bit of a funny guy to sort of understand? Yes, he's a bit fiery, a bit like his mother, but he's learning and he's getting better every time. He, uh, he got to the stage where he was very difficult to get from the uh, mounting yard to the barrier because horses had galloped past him and he didn't like that. They galloped past him while he was still walking and that upset him and got him on the wrong track and now he's gradually getting better. It was a really good performance on day uh, first up over the 1,600 metres. Dropped back to the 15 today. Do you think this is a guy that's going to enjoy stepping up out of that further ground? Well, it probably would have been better to have gone up in distance rather than back. And uh, his next start, I'll be looking to put him over a little bit further and uh, stretch him out a bit just to see how far he can go. Looking forward to seeing uh, when that occurs. So congratulations on the win there, Bob. Thank you. Come back in with plenty of mud all over his face, but as we heard earlier with Lucy, you don't mind getting a bit dirty when you get a winner like that? No, when they let down and get you out of trouble like that, uh, yeah, it's worth getting dirty for. Were you nervous? Absolutely. Um, you know, all day I've struggled to find a part of the track that I'm happy with, and you know, I really haven't found a part that I'm happy with. I've been wide and different things, and just seen a couple, the odd horse stick to the fence and make ground, so I, when the, op the, you know, the opportunity presents itself, I'll do that. But, uh, you know, still needed a fair bit of luck. Just tell us about the run throughout. Obviously, a slower way, but you decided to really punch up on the inside to try and get a couple of places forward. And I think you probably moved three pairs up, but doing that meant that you were stuck there at the top of the straight as well. Yeah, it's sort of like, it looks like a great move early. And then mid-race when everyone out wide's flowing forward, you're kind of thinking, oh, maybe it wasn't such a great move. But I rode in for luck and I got the luck, so it was my day paid off and it normally does for W Pike as well. Just quickly on the horse, uh, Bob's mentioned a couple of the quirks there and I asked him uh, about that he just doesn't seem to respond as well to the whip, seems to love the hands and heels. Do you feel that as well? Uh, I'm probably pretty lucky. I haven't had to go for it yet so I'll tell you when I have to go for it whether he finds another length. Well done mate. Good way to finish the card. Thank you.